everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to restore Google One Backup. Post your data, Google One Backups help you restore contacts, messages, and files, and I'll show you how to restore a Google One Backup step by step. So let's follow these few simple steps together. The first step is to check up uh, backup availability. And to do that, just go to one.google.com and then log in using your account's credentials. Now here, after you log in using your account's credentials, click on storage and search for device backup. As you can see here, the option backup your device. Now as you can see on Android, uh, Android device that uh, and mess messages and attachments and photos and videos can be backed up in the Google OneDrive. And uh, in iOS, you can uh, back up Google Calendars, Google Contacts, and Google Photos and videos. You can also import photos from Facebook to Google Photos and import photos from iCloud to Google Photos. The second step is to restore on a new device. Now, if setting up a new phone, select Restore from Google Backup during the setup and sign in with the same Google account. As for the third step, is to restore specific data. And to do that, just go to Google Drive, and then go to Backup, to Restore Files. Let's go to Google Drive, and then go to Backups to restore the files. As for Photos, open Google Photos, and then go to Library and then Backups. Now for the fourth and final step, restore apps and settings. Now on an Android device, just go to settings and then go to Google and click on backup and tap restore. Now backup the data expires after 57 days if unused. You can restore Google One backups on iPhone except for photos. And that's it for today's tutorial. That's how you restore Google One backup. Just sign in and select the data to restore. If you like this video and found this helpful, please like and subscribe and feel free to leave a comment below the video if you have further or more questions about this topic. Thanks for watching and see you again in the next tutorial.